Good morning, beautiful people. It's Monday. Thank you for stopping by on my YouTube channel, even a terror once again. I hope you're in a good mood. I hope you are already in Christmas mood because, guys, you can see I am. Okay, so December 6, 2021 is in front of us. And what will happen? Let's talk about love. Let's talk about you. Let's talk about them. Let's see who is coming towards you. Sit back, enjoy and have some fun. Let's get started. Clarity, honey. You will get a clarity. I think this is rather important. Whether you are man or woman, we need clarity, guys. And especially nowadays. Now, I can and I will. I will draw another oracle card. And then we will talk about your love life promise ah uh, this is big this is big guys you know so there is a uh, clarity and there is a promise so somebody will promise you something now let's dive into our reading and let's see what is going on okay let me reshuffle my cards and then we will see what this is all about Clarity. You need to talk with them. They want to talk to you. You will get a promise. You know, someone will promise you something. Let's see. Ah, uh, Knight of Cups. Yeah, baby. Now we are talking. You know, some serious love promise. As I can see, could be. Doesn't have to be, but could be. Cancer, Pisces, Scorpio. Generally speaking, Knight of Cups. Uh, could be any, 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 any person. We can see a man offering you a clarity. You see in his right hand, he have a cup. He is coming slowly but surely towards you with an explanation or showing his feelings or showing finally his feelings. And there is a promise. So I think this Monday will surprise many 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 of you uh on basically on the best you know possible way generally speaking knight of cups is person who is very romantic so i can see promising romantic day i can see very promising romantic you know person refined and sensitive rather shy and rather slow but guys never mind it's better ever than never okay i like what i see because i know this is typical so-called prince charming i like this at least so far let me see the hero font guys hero font is beautiful card hero font will appear in the reading when there is something very traditional traditional person traditional suitor person who knows quality and value of the family guys this is very very serious reading as far as i can see so major kind of the hero fund talks about all traditional things person who is and will be dedicated to you and to your uh, family to to your relationship uh, this person is experienced uh, this person is good advisor, whether this is this person giving some advices to you or taking care for you, nurturing you. This person is very uh, committed type of person. I can say strong bond between the two of you. Even if there is a need to sacrifice because of you, this person still will stay with you. So basically, guys, I like what I see. Some of you need clarity and some of you need promise. But generally speaking, I think in general, people need both, you know. Can you promise you will stay? Can you promise you will be always truthful to me, you know. This type of conversation, guys, I can see. So beside Cancer Pisces Scorpio, also I can see 
Virgo, Taurus, or Capricorn. Eight of Pentacles talks about mostly job, working and being, you know, down to earth, tangible, you know, basically working hard. Okay, I don't think you need to work that hard for your marriage or love relationship. Simply, this is your everyday job, everyday tasks, you know, guys, you know, normal, everyday, you know, life for every single one, one of us. So, Eight of Pentacles is saying, okay, be patient, results are coming, you just do your thing, don't be lazy. So, this person also, for some of you, could be very inspiring, you know, person with whom you can talk about, about your dream, like your financial dream, your business dream, because so far everything looks like very down to earth, very down to earth. So I like what I see, no struggles, no harsh, weird, you know, intensity, you know, or whatever. Usually we get, guys, you know, some harsh, you know, cards, but I hope, you know, today everything will go so smoothly. Eight of Swords, okay. Eight of Swords is like end street, like uh, when people can't see an entrance when people can't see an exit, when people do not know how to deal. Eight of Swords is a rather difficult card when you don't know how, how, how to think about, you know, someone. Some of you are in tears. Some of you could be a little bit confused. Some of you need to walk away from hostile person, hostile colleague, hostile environment in general. Maybe this darling of yours need to go somewhere and this is you saying like you know goodbye honey you know come back you know as soon as it possible i think could be not like a walking away in emotional sense this could be connected with the job because those two tarot cards are closely connected with the job so i promise i will come back i promise i am yours I promise, and guys, you know, whatever, any type of, you know, combination. So, let me see what else will happen during this day. Major Canada hanged man. Okay, so this person was walking away probably because of job or some issues in family. Or could be guys, just anything at all. Major Canada hanged man is saying this person is doing this unwillingly. This is not like weird type of idea. It's like necessity of life. Still, I can see someone in tears. Let me repeat once again. This is not a breakup. No. At the contrary, you know, this person will come back. So it's like temporary living, temporary, I don't know, something, something. Because of job, because of, you know, family, because of, you know, some, could be guys, anything, you know. So Major Colonel the Hanged Man is about waiting so what you should do you should surrender to current circumstances before this person do their thing okay maybe you ain't gonna like that but you know it's necessity probably because of money this type of you know situation so you just surrender little honey you just surrender uh, your wishes now could be limited, but also there is a twist of fate. When this person come back with a pocket full of money, then you will change your mind. So it's like necessity of life, but still I can see this Prince Charming, what this means. It means person who really, really care for you, you know. Three of Swords, wow painful separation but guys it looks like this needs to happen okay because of eight of swords and three of swords maybe you need to walk away some of you need to talk for some of you guys this means very serious conversation with a person that care for you this person care for you no doubt about that so please don't show long face or whatever simply talk 
I'm telling you, this is not a breakup. For those of you who are still single, let me see. If you're single, you still think a lot about your ex. And even if you're single, and even if this is appearance of your ex, uh, I think you will talk with this ex of yours about something. Could be joint assets, joint, I don't know, investment, house or something. Six of Wands, thank you, Lord, I need this card. And exactly now, Six of Swords basically showing a big victory. So this day is going to be victorious for you, especially guys, you see when I connect Eight of Pentacles and Six of uh, Wands, it means, generally speaking, this is your money situation. You see, money situation. Like you are getting, you know, more from, uh, could be a raise for some of you, you are getting more and more, like like a final uh, result of your, of your endeavors, right? For love reading, Six of Wands is a very, very strong energy of Leo, and we tend to call Leo in astrology uh, the winner, right? right? So, first something maybe you lose and then you will win. It's not like a truthful win or lose. It's more like daily life necessity. It's like, you know, 50-50. But I don't think you are losing anything at all. And guys, you see, you know, before this person do their thing, you will get an answer and you will get a promise. Could be a spouse, your partner, could be even your ex. Uh, could be even your friend, guys, you know, I don't know, your private, you know, situation. But with a six of wands, I know, I know, I know, this is not like farewell. This is just, you know, goodbye, see you soon. In so, guys, you know, you know what I'm saying. Six of wands is one of the best cards you can get, which talks about respect, awards, and... And victory three of pentacles so basically how many pentacles we have one two traditional something three of pentacles achieving your goal achieving your goal so it's like necessity of life but you will get what you are looking for you will get a clarity either this is you crying or either this is them crying, but because of necessity, because of life necessity, something of that kind will happen. So what you should do, surrender and just wait, because whoever this person is, they are coming back again soon. You see guys, this is, you know, what is going on. In the meantime, Think about your life, think about how you can improve yourself or your life. And this is our daily tarot reading. Comment, like, share and subscribe. God bless.